everybody, this is Dean DeCosta. Today we're talking a new tool called Who Knows. Who Knows is a phenomenal tool. It's basically a database. They have 307 point, roughly 8 million people. This is not just LinkedIn, boys and girls. This is anywhere and everywhere. As you can see, I'm right there up top. Don't know why. I just am. Email's good. Everything's good. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a little search. What we're going to do is we're going to go by keyword. We're going to ask for Java. Then we're going to ask for a Hadoop. And we're going to just wait. We'll see what we come up with. Gives it a second or two or three or four. Got to do its thing. A lot of people it's looking up. I mean, you think about it. 5 million Java slash do people. Now that's worldwide. Let's layer that down a little bit and get to, let's say Seattle. That's where I'm at, Seattle, Washington. Let's do a little inquiry minds would like to know in Seattle only. Give it a minute or two or three or four or five. And look at that, 14,837 people that have Java and Hadoop. Wow. And what's really great about that, um, if you look at it, you see where it says show contact information? You can actually get the contact. This tells you the percentage that they match. This is where you can get your contact information. You see here we got one right there because I've looked at them before. Some social sites, Facebook, whatever. Let's get contact information on Ionet Rusu. Uh, I hope I spelled the name right. Ionet, 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 meh, who knows? Well, we'll find out. Anyway, so let's see. Oh, look at this. We got their work email and we got a phone number. Uh, we got a whole bunch of other. Now, it's interesting. The phone number is out of town. Uh, email address seems to be two. He says he's in Seattle. My guess is he was originally from out of the U.S. and now has moved in. Let's go ahead and do this one more time with another person. We'll do Alexander Fedorov. Um, not the tennis player either. Um, so let's see what happened. We already know he works at uh, Amazon. He's worked at Luff. He's got three other companies worked at. There's an email address. There's his LinkedIn profile. All sorts of good stuff. So good night stuff. Now. What can you do? Obviously, you can see the top five results. You can see more. Um, we can filter results with contact information. We can um, do personal email, work email, phone number, all that good stuff. And of course, as you can imagine, we can actually grab somebody and we can do stuff with them, including uh, exporting them. Like in this case, I could export him. So let's see what happens if we export him. We export him. How many personal we to export? We're going to do that. And then you're going to get an email with a CSV with all the info on the person. Nice, pretty, easy, beautiful cover girl. Really cool. Other stuff. They've got an organization insights. So let's see what that is. Insights, what we know. This is a sample dashboard. Now, this is if you are using their tool to keep an eye on profiles and skills listing and stuff like that. This is just a sample dashboard of what it would look like for you. All sorts of neat information is available to you. Just really cool. Um, but the search is the biggie. Your search, your ability to download, your physically upload, your ability to do all that. Here's download right there. Export search results. Save. Please select at least one filter before you save. Uh, we don't have any right now, but I'm just saying you can download the search results. That's pretty cool. You can download all of them. So good tool. Another place to search for people, reasonably priced when you get beyond the free part because it is partially free. And then you have this thing up here called advanced search. Now, if we press that, look at all the extra advanced features you now get to do expertise, experience, education, relationship, keywords, first name, last name, in case you had someone specific you want to look for, gender, ethnicity, all sorts of stuff. Good little tool. Does a pretty good job. Uh, definitely one's recommended. This is Dean DeCosta, and this was Who Knows.